That's a pain. That's gonna end up floating away if I'm not quick. Yep, brilliant. That is exactly what I did not want to happen. What's up guys and welcome back. So today I thought I would start a brand new series. Um, I've been playing Strand Deep for quite a while now and annoyingly it, was, it sort of glitched out that I couldn't get anything past level 5 so the craftsmanship, all of that sort of stuff I couldn't get past level 5 um, which means I couldn't get the gyrocopter which is a pain but I thought I'm fairly experienced at this game now, I know what I'm doing. Um, so I thought it'd be quite fun to start a brand new series and try and get everything done in terms of killing all the boss creatures like the Megalodon um, and the giant squid and he's called Luska the Great or however you say his name um, as well as finally getting on the plane, repairing the plane and getting our way back to land or home should I say so yeah, this is going to be part of a, um, a long series, which I'm quite looking forward to doing. And yeah, hopefully I can give you some guys some tips along the way, um, and we'll see how it goes. So the first thing I need to do is get to land. And I need my paddle. I am going to miss my, uh, my man-made raft though, because this thing is so bad. This raft, this inflatable dinghy. I mean, I'm already stuck against a rock. I don't even know if I can paddle backwards. I might have to get out and drag it, I think. That's going well so far. I'm already stuck against a rock. Stupid bloody dinghy. To be honest, I'm just going to swim it. Swim it there. Leave it there. Uh, so we'll do this little tutorial, get that out of the way. First, we need two sticks. At least there's a couple of wrecks here and there's a few things scattered around which is good. I don't know if there's any, I can't see any big shipwrecks so I probably won't stay on this island for long. You don't really want to stay on the first island, it's not usually that great. It's just to get you set up to be honest. That is a couple of sticks. It's going to be really weird going from a uh, having everything in a camp full of stuff, I could literally turn around and I would have a pile of rocks, a pile of sticks. Um, and now I've got absolutely nothing. Alright, so... We need to, what is it asking me to do? Ah, oh, make a stone tool. The crafting menu, pin the knife. And we need some... Need some lashings. Oh, yeah. 
Let's get that bad boy out. I don't know if you can <laughs> if you can hear that, but I can still hear the water noises. So I'm just gonna go in the water and hopefully come back out and that'll stop. I don't know. Well, this game well so far. I'm just gonna I don't know if you can hear that or not. If you can then I I have no idea what's going on. But I'll build a camp, I'll save it, and then uh I'll come out and go back in and hopefully it'll sort that out. <laughs> Come on. There we go. And skip. I tell you, it's weird going from one game to the other, especially as I've obviously been playing a couple of different survival games, and all the controls are completely different. So I'm pressing something to get the menu up, and it's bringing up something completely different. I need to, oh, I want to build a shower so I can get the stupid noise out. That's gonna absolutely bug the hell out of me. Alright, let's get some wood. I don't know if you guys can hear that, or if it's just maybe coming through on mine. I'm assuming if I can hear it, you guys can hear it. So annoying. But annoyingly as well, I can't come off it and well, I'd have to start again, which I guess wouldn't be that bad. Chuck that way because you can it lasts forever, so you don't need to make that many of them. So, well, don't chuck it away, but you don't want to hold on to it. Uh, oh, yeah, the meat. This is my tool belt as well. Right, now I can make a shelter. What do I need? I think I need these. Okay, and we're back. So I don't know if you could hear that or not, but it was just the sound of when you go in the water, uh, obviously you can hear the the waves and stuff like that. I could still hear it when I came back out of the water. It sounded as if I was still in it. So uh, I don't know if you could hear that or not. Um, 
if you couldn't, then yeah, that's it was bugging the hell out of me. So I had to just quickly log log well, go off the game and then go back on it again. It seems to be fine now, but I don't know whether. I mean, I might quickly go back in the water and see if it's going to be a problem because that's going to be a pain. So it was this noise that you can hear now, and then I came out. Okay, it's all good. Well, that was fun. All right. Anyway, so we've cooked this meat. And I think that's the uh, tutorial over with. I think that's it. I think that's all the help it gives you. So we can put that out. Don't need that any longer. Um, all these sort of things. That I don't really use the sun cream that often, to be honest. So the aloe vera is for sun cream. Um, you need a coconut flask, and you make sun cream with it. I just don't really use it. Uh, I just dip in the water or stand in the shade for a little bit to let my um, it's the SPF down there at the bottom uh, so right now I probably could use it but yeah I just I can never be bothered to, to make it this stuff um, I can't remember what that's used to make off the top of my head I think it's the ooh, what is what is it for I can't remember off the top of my head right these are 100% useful so you want to definitely every tarp you see because you can make the water stills with these and they are so useful uh, so we'll just keep, we'll leave them by the camp for now we'll just have a look around and see what we've got on the island I don't actually know how much I can make at this level uh, can I make a hammer at all yes I can make a hammer so to make like a raft and stuff you need a hammer um, so it's probably worth making one of them um, as soon as possible. But I don't know what level you have to be. Okay, so I could actually make a wooden raft straight away. Yeah, so it might be worth doing that because um, that rubber dinghy is the most useless thing on this game. Oh, I didn't want to drop it. So we're just uh, the first island you get to, you just want to scavenge everything, just pick everything up because all of it will come in handy, especially in early game. But um, if you can find some of the the uh, flowers and stuff like that, especially pee pee, uh, that stuff is like gold dust because you'll lose track of the times you get poisoned by the stupid poisonous starfish on the edge of the water that move over time one minute they'll be there and you'll be like right I need to avoid that area because they're over there and then you'll go do something you'll come back and it'll be over here and you fuck, you end up treading on it and it's the most annoying thing ever so yeah uh, if I find some I'll um, show you what you need and you 100% want to keep it on you or at your camp make sure you always have some and then as soon as you can set up farms and stuff, you want to grow it as quickly as possible. Um, but I can't actually find any to show you. Oh, is this some of it? Here we go. This is it here. So we get that out quickly. This stuff will save you so much hassle. Trust me. So if you've come across this stuff, make sure you pick it up. The aloe vera and the... <laughs> I'm probably going to get the name wrong. The Wava... Oh, God. Wava Lavula. Wava Lavula? Yeah. It's not that important early game. Okay, so ideally we want to make a hammer, I think. Or if I can... Yeah, I think I'm going to make a tool belt. Because they come in... As soon as you can make these tool belts... Oh, then make them because they're so handy you can just quickly pull out pull out your knife by pressing one of the directional buttons rather than having to go into the menu scroll around etc um, I've shown in one of my other videos I did a tutorial on how to make and use the tool belt so if you do need help with that just check them out so I need some lashing so I'm gonna need to we'll just drop all this stuff here for now um, we're actually looking for the fibrous leaves at the moment. 
which you get off these guys. I did not see him there. I thought I'd poison myself then. I was like, ah, oh, so that was quick. Alright, there we go. So, to make some machines, I need to go back and. Oh, here they are. Pick up one of my tarps and should be able to make my first tool belt. There we go. So, what we'll do is we need to put that in there. And like that, and then I can quickly pull out the knife. Right, so we will just chuck some of this stuff down here in a pile. Oh, this is what we need. So these things, you want to smack the shite out of these because you get quite a nice array of fibrous leaves off them. Um, it's just annoying when they fill in, fall into these bushes and you've got to hunt around for them. I still got that, there we go. So there should be one more, I think. But I don't think I can be bothered to try and hunt for it. Oh, there it is. Ah, there's one there. So I want to keep those two. For this oh, I picked it. Oh, well, I'm gonna pick this one as well. So we want to keep these two. Um, as soon as you can make a, a uh, farming plot, then that'd be handy because you can make medicine with them. I believe it's medicine. It's the uh, the guave. Oh. Uh, don't need that. Don't need that. Uh, I'll keep them for now. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to transport all this, to be honest, because I haven't got any uh, crates. Um, so I'm tempted to make a raft while I'm on this. Uh, tempted to make a raft while I'm on this island, just because I cannot stand that rubber dinghy. It'll take me about half an hour to get over to that island over there. It's probably not the first one I'm going to go to. I'll go to one that's slightly closer. Although at the moment, uh, looking at it, it's probably that one over there. I mean, that's still miles away. I think I need to make a hammer anyway. Uh, so let's have a look at that. So I need lashings and two rocks. Have I got enough things for that? All right, so I just need two rocks, which I think I've chucked over here. There we go. Drop that down there. So I've got myself a hammer. Let's just check what my... Uh... Okay, so... My crafting is level 1 still, but my harvesting is level 2. I really hope it's not going to bug out and get stuck on level 5 again, because it's a massive pet. I really... I had so much stuff. I had so many gyrocopter uh, mechanical parts and stuff like that, and I couldn't make it. Uh, what's the time? Oh, it's quarter to eleven, so I think I might uh, sleep on it now. Uh, probably give it a save. And then we'll think about moving to a, a better island and actually settling down. And um, I'll check out that shipwreck over there. I'll have a quick look around the island. I don't think there's any more. Um, yeah, I need to make a raft. I don't know whether to make a raft here or just paddle with that bloody thing and then make a raft at the next place. Right, let's have a quick sleep. So it was, I think it was 11 and now it's half five. Alright, so the moon's going down, sun will rise in a second and then I'll be able to see what I'm doing. Is that another crab? Yeah, probably need to eat again soon. Oh, I need to drink. Got myself a coconut. Check that down there. Alright, here comes the sun. 
Here comes the sun. Do -do -do -do. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find anything. I'll tell you what I do need is a torch. Or to just wait until the sun comes up, probably. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else. I was hoping there'd be a crate, so I'd be able to chuck some stuff in it, but it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. I think that's just a rock. That is a shame. So there's nothing here at all. Um, oh, to be fair, oh, I think I am going to have to use this blooming thing. Because I don't really want to use it. I don't want to leave it here. So I'm going to have to uh, probably go to that island over there, I think. Maybe I might have to just leave this stuff here for now. I'll take some of the more useful things like that. Tarp. Oh, hang on. Um, so rocks and sticks can stay because you find them everywhere. Okay, that's not what I wanted to drop. Uh, so pick that up. Pick that up. Definitely pick the PP up. And I will quickly save it before I go, just in case I get attacked by a rogue shark or something. So I think I'm ready to go. I haven't left it. Ah. That was close. Right. Let's turn this stupid boat around and see what happens. Can I chuck it? You can. Okay. Right, so we're going to head for this island over here. Uh, looks like a fairly decent sized island. Looks like it's got quite a few trees. Um, some rocks over there. I'm not sure if it will be where we set up our main base. Um, although, saying that. It's quite a tall island, so it'd be quite easy to find. We'll see what it's like when we get over there. But this was this is the this sort of island here. Obviously, you look around um, all the other islands. That one you can barely see over there in the distance. I know I'm close to this one, but the the tall trees give it quite a, a landmark feature, which you can easily easily see from a distance compared to I can hear the water moving I don't know if that's a tiger shark following me which it probably is so I'm not going to look I'm going to keep going oh, so there is a shipwreck quite a big one as well by the looks of it I'm, I don't think I've seen one like that before and it looks like there's a container there in the water I've, I don't think I've seen a shipwreck like that not that big it looks massive Which is good. I, at the moment, I think I might um, set up my permanent base on this island, which would be quite handy. So I can cut down all the smaller trees and leave the big ones, and then I'll be able to see, well, hopefully, the uh, plan. There's another shipwreck over there, yeah. So it's looking promising. I'm pretty sure there's a tiger shark behind me. Oh no, it's a hammerhead shark. I thought there was. thought I was being followed. Uh, I'm going to want to pull that in before... Oh, that's a pain. That's going to end up floating away if I'm not quick. Yep, brilliant. That is exactly what I did not want to happen. Yeah, so that is a problem. There's a bloody hammerhead swimming around, and now... <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I can't get to my dinghy. You bastard. He's just waiting for me. 
Oh, God. It's just going further and further away as well. Oh, and it's got my cans of food and my... Oh, it's got my compass in it. I'm going to have to get it back. How am I going to get that back? I'm going to have to make some spears quickly. And I think I'm, I'm bleeding as well. Lovely. Right. Oh, God. I'm going to have to be quick. Ah. Wow, this was a good island. There's already a shelter set up over here. Lashings. Uh. <gasps> Found Wilson. I can't believe I've just found Wilson. I don't care if he's called Wally on the game. That is Wilson. Oh, mate, I'm so happy. That has, that has made this episode already. Wow. So this is, uh, this is the island that Tom Hanks lost his rubber dinghy. Look at it, it's just floating away. I really need to be quick and make some... Spears. Any spears in here? Oh, I've got a fishing spear. That won't do the trick though. So lots of lashings, which is good. Oh, and there's Tom Hanks. There he is. I didn't even see that skeleton there. I thought it was a load of spears. I mean, Tom Hanks doesn't die on it, but... Um... Oh, there's a spear. That's quite handy. So I need eight of these. Um... Oh, I'm carrying too much stuff, right? This is definitely going to be my, my island. 100%. I mean, look at it. I've got this little shelter here. Anyway, right, I need to go and get my rubber dinghy. Oh, I don't want to swim out there. Right. Oh, I've actually got enough to make the spears. I've got four sticks, so we'll quickly make all these spears up. Okay. I think I've got one spare, so I can afford to miss one. Oh, I wonder what that was then. I thought it was an arrow. Alright, where is this? Oh, yeah. I need... Oh, bloody hell. I need some water. Oh, God. I have to kill that guy as well. I can't see him. Ah, there he is. Right, I'm going to kill you quickly. Oh, God. There we go. Last thing I want on my island is a Bloody rattlesnake. Thank you very much. I'll have my spear back. There we go. I don't know if there's boars. I think there's a boar there. Well, this, there is as well. This, this is the perfect island. Couldn't have gone any better. Right, uh, what am I am after a coconut, aren't I? Keep getting sidetracked. Oh, onto my spear. I need to drop some uh, some stuff quickly. Uh, my coconut. No, just drink that. And just quickly get another one. I really want to go kill the shark. I bet it will be nowhere to be seen now as well. No, I've got to try and swim all the way out there. I've got no chance. Alright, so I've got two spares. Oh man, I've got to try and get out there. I'm bleeding as well. Oh, I need cloth. Oh, nightmare. Nightmare. <laughs> I've got no chance. Absolutely no chance of making that. I don't think it's even worth trying to get it. I mean, this is exactly why I saved it before I came over here. So what I can actually do is just go back, uh, load it back on again, and just make my way back over here. And then I won't have taken the bleed effect from the shark. Because um, at the moment, I can't see him. So I, I don't think I'm going to bother with my rubber dinghy for now. I'm going to have a look at the ship. Because, again, if it doesn't have what I want in it, I can just... I've not seen a ship this big before. 
And I played the game for ages on my other low on my other save. So we got some we got two lots of boys, so I can make two uh bases for my boat, my raft. Uh can I open this door? Hmm, I think I can, but I don't know how. Probably with a pick or something. Um, to get in there. Is that the only way in? No, there's a door here. Okay, so we're in. I'm excited. I've not actually... I've never found this boat before. Um, physical... Physical... Physical? Okay, so what we got on here... Nothing, just these two lockers. Okay. Oh, there's cloth. So I could actually make a bandage and stop myself from bleeding. If I didn't want to go and get my rub... I kind of want to keep my rubber dinghy. That's the only thing. And it is the exact reason I saved it before I came over here. I mean, I've lost sight of it now. Oh, there it is. Ah, there's the hammerhead. Right, you know what? We are going to kill this hammerhead. I will have revenge. Right, how am I going to do this? I need to get in the water with him so he'll come towards me. Ah, but not... I don't really want to be in here. Uh, this ship's too big, to be honest. Oh, this is a pain. Right, how are we going to do this? Because these barriers are... I can't, like, fire the spear over the barriers. There he is. There's one. One bloody spear. Oh, there he is. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Right, okay. I think that's the problem. That they're so quick. And I can't stay down because I'm on this thing. The wave keeps bringing me up. So if I try and stay under... I need to get over there. Over there. I'm gonna make a break for it. Right, so that boat would actually be quite good. Um, so I'm gonna go for it. Because I don't think he can get to me. Um, but I could be wrong. I don't think he can get to me with these barriers here, but he'll probably prove me wrong. Um, that's if he even shows up. Oh, there he is. Ah, oh, so dark. He just disappears instantly. Ah, um, oh, there he is. That's three. Only five more to go. I mean, at least I'm getting my physical skill up. Come on. There we go. I haven't, uh, this is going to take me ages. Right, I might just skip to the, uh, the last spear if I can. If he comes back. Okay, guys, so I did actually log, sort of log out and log back in and uh, <laughs> brought my raft with me this time. <laughs> It's not a major thing, but it does have a uh, few essentials in here. How's this? The rations, which are helpful uh, when we eventually make our way out of the game. Because uh, I think we need to take them with us to get on the plane. Uh, and it has my compass, which I didn't really want to lose so early in the game. So I'm going to end this uh, part one here, because that was sort of like a, an introduction. We made it to the first island, set ourselves up. And so next time we're going to explore the island properly um, and we'll have a, look at these, have a look at these ships and hopefully build a raft. Um, I forgot to say as well that shark, I didn't actually see it again after I said I'd come back for the last spear. It disappeared into the wilderness and I didn't see it again. Uh, and I couldn't be bothered to wait around for it for god knows how long so I thought you know what I'll just quickly load it, um, log out, log back in and bring my rubber dinghy with me so yeah we're gonna end it there i hope you enjoyed that um 
There's a couple of fun bits in there. Me getting attacked by a shark straight away. Found Wilson literally straight away. I didn't even find him on the other game, and I've played that for ages. So I'm happy about that. Um, and yeah, it looks like this is going to be where we're setting up our main base. I mean, it's got everything I need. It's got rattlesnakes. <laughs> it's got it's got boars on here. So I've got, like I said, I've got leather, um, plenty of trees, plenty of fish, plenty of shipwrecks. So yeah, next time we'll um, we'll explore and we'll see what happens. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you did enjoy it, then please hit the like button. And if you want to see the rest of the series that I'll be bringing out, then make sure you hit that subscribe button and you won't miss an episode. Thanks a lot, guys, and I will see you guys soon. We're in